Yeah, Sly, how are you, man? I'm fine, man. Good, good. Fine. You know, I did. This is a, this is a beautiful RV you got here, man. Thank you. It's new, huh? Well, pretty new. To me, albinos are the 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 real legitimate minority group in the world. Okay. Because they are in all of our races, and we all shun them. I do too. We treat them like they're ugly, and their eyes go around, and and we don't, you know, we, we don't really. That's the way we treat them. And okay. We, you know, and, and they accept it, and that's what's terrible. So you know, I just. Wanna, so you want to give me a song? Yeah, I want to give you a song. Give me a song, and, and and I'll see what I can do about about getting it exposure and getting it out there. Well, I mean, all you got to do is just have it on there. Just, yeah, I don't care. You know, it's, it's free. Okay. Just have people, I don't, you know, free or donation. Put on, you put, you put on YouTube. Yeah. We could do that. Yeah. We could do that for you. Yeah. I think, well, anybody should be really want to do that. It's just a free a song. Anybody should want to do that. Yeah. And so I'm trying to really give it to you. Uh... Because I just felt like it. Of course. <laughs> so let's hear it. Okay, I'll give you the words to it anyway. Sure. Can you yeah. sing it a little bit? Well, I'm too hoarse right now. Give, me, uh, give, give us a taste. But I'll give you the words for it. From the legend, it. sure. It says, uh, give the kid a flag, you teach him to salute. You give the kid a gun, you teach him how to shoot. One day, the kid's in the bushes, he starts to cry. Because never, ever, nobody taught him how to die. He said, he's in the bushes, and there's no more blood to give. He said, his odds are, are, his odds are, say he's dying, but his God said he would live. And there's more. Love it, you love know, it. Yeah, yeah. No, that's good. Let me ask you this, I gotta ask you. Yeah, sure. How did you end up where you're at? You're, you're living out of a van in the Crenshaw district of Los Angeles. Oh. How yeah. does that happen to a music legend? Because that was, to tell you the truth, I'm there a lot because it's very comfortable for me because uh, I don't like to be in any one place under the circumstances with this lawsuit and being, people are getting killed and, and, and people are getting I mean, the players in the uh, lawsuit are getting killed. And uh, I don't really, I'm not really into that. I don't really care about no $50 million. I, which which lawsuit? There's, there's a lawsuit having to do with uh, a lot of monies that have been stolen. But from I, from who? From you? No, yeah, for, yeah for, you know, monies that have been fraud, like fraud, fraudulently. Uh, I have... Uh, like this, this one guy signed his name. Uh, yeah. I'll tell you, fuck it, I'll tell you, man. Okay. That, see, as far as I'm concerned, within the music business, it goes along. With, unless, unless a guy's playing music or recording the music, all those other guys are doing business. And usually they're dipping their hands a little bit more than they. Oh, I mean, I know that. So, I, you know, I know this, this guy, Jerry Goldstein, he doesn't make him a bad big guy. He just said he got a little too greedy. And, uh, you know, and people, people like you, people that want, want to, uh, yeah, there are people that like me, or, you know, my fans, and people that love me, and you know, they want to take them out and all that shit. And I don't know why, I'm not into that. I, you know, well, let, let me let me ask you this. There, um, so you sold all of your music rights to Michael Jackson. Is that true? Well, now here's what happened. Uh, at a point, I go my life to the truth. I've always had too much money. It would never run out, and it won't run out. Really. Now, forgive me. Tell me about this uh, this this Michael Jackson thing. How you sold your rights? Well, so we well, see. Uh, there was a very, very uh, sophisticated businessman that uh, was was really he got this title of the uh, what do you call the saint that came along, and he was I got, got to respect him for it because he is a good businessman. Um, what 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 happens with me? Because I tell you the honest guy truth. When people, there, there are people that like to stack up money and they, they like that. 
And I don't give a fuck, man. I just like toys, you know what I mean? Okay. You know, <laughs> get the toys, you know, get the kids toys. And so at the time you wanted you wanted toys and you were okay selling your music? Well, yeah, I mean, I didn't even care about the, 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 the price of it, but check this out. The, uh, the guy that did the negotiation for me, for Michael, I don't really believe that Michael... Yeah. You know what? It was for... Well, what, what I got was $125,000. Wow. 